All right, so here we got uh, an American firecracker and a Chinese firecracker. Today, I'm gonna be comparing the two, to see the differences between both of them. So I'm in the woods right now. Here's some deer walking around. And uh, here we got your American firecracker. It'd be nice if it would focus on it. Just using my phone right now, the iPhone 11 camera. But that is an American firecracker. This is a black cat little dynamite. There we go. You got clay in the bottom. It's plugged. So that's just a little dynamite by Black Cat Fireworks. It's uh, waterproof. And uh, here we got a legit Chinese firecracker. I was able to find a strip of 50 of these for um, $7.50 somewhere. It is legit. The wrapper had Chinese lettering on it. You see, just straight powder in there. And on the bottom, no clay, just crimped at the bottom. Just flash powder all over these things. You're gonna get dirty whenever you touch these. So um, there's a possibility we might not have any big firecrackers next year in the U.S. at all. So you have to enjoy these and save up some while they do last right now. And let's uh, test these out, see how they compare. Switch to uh, ultra wide mode. Test these in ultra wide so you guys can see uh, all the tissue paper from the Chinese one. Probably see some paper all over the floor or all over the ground from the Chinese ones. They cause a little bit of a mess. So let's try out the um, American firecracker first. And then we'll try out the Chinese one. Okay, there's a nice little bang from that. Um, not sure if it caused any damage, but those do decent amount of damage for what they're supposed to do they are like i'm pretty sure the max limit for a legal american firecracker probably the best that we're going to be able to find here in the next few years coming up so here we have a chinese firecracker bad thing about this is the fuse is so fast so uh, let's see how this goes Much louder, ears are ringing, and we do have some damage and some tissue paper. Ears still can barely hear. Those are pretty powerful with straight flash powder. Probably not that safe with the quick fuse, but um, yeah, pretty nice. Do not want to hold those in your hands and throw them. But yeah, probably make a video with like the 25 strip that I have left because I took a bunch off and then I've been lighting them like that, saving up a few. So see you guys in the next video and thanks for watching.